The stage is set and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? We'll have all the action for you next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal versus Argentina. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And the game begins. De Paul. Otamendi has it. Giovanni Lo Celso. Martinez. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And over it comes. Not the best clearance. Lionel Messi. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Well, it's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal. It's worth remembering that they finished second in the qualifying group. They had to go through playoff matches against Turkey and North Macedonia just to get to the 2022 finals. And this past month has been challenging as well, but they're here and they have a well-earned track record as winners. Well, you're absolutely right, but I think they've got better and better as the tournament has worn on. They've got a great understanding of what's required of each player on the pitch. They're good tactically, they've been fit, and I think they've got every chance of being the world champions here, but they're going to have to play well. Martinez! Oh, that goes down as a wonderful save, but the offside flag has gone up and it grinds to a halt. Joao Cancelo. Well, Diogo Jota is the sort of player who can perplex opponents with his skill. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? 
Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Pepe. It's with Ruben Nervis. Well-timed tackle. He continues his run. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Pull from the keeper, and they'll come again. That's a go. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Elects to go short. Firing is in. Putting his body on the line. Must score! And the keeper more than equal to it. Argentina will get the throw in. They couldn't maintain possession. Can he play it in? Di Maria. Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work with. Well, they fancy a short one. Di Maria. Able to get a body in the way. Diaz. It's with Joao Cancelo. Applying vigorous pressure. Martinez. Has a go! Oh, that's a fine save. And short it is. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? Superb block. Ottavio. Silva. And out for a throw in. Just misfiring with the pass. Lo Celso. Well, it's been a good last 15 minutes for Argentina. They're having most of the ball now and created a hatful of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. Oh, breezing past him. Could be. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Short corner taken. Messi. And the keeper making sure that there were no straps to feed on for the attackers. Bernardo Silva. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Silva. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Now well, Molina. Being pressed and pressed high. Martinez. Shot attempted. Determined block. They've regained possession. Messi. And Messi! Well, the 
keeper had to concentrate. Messi with the corner. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Ruben Neves. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Giovanni Lo Celso. Rodrigo De Paul. Plenty of support here. Beautifully weighted ball. Well, the flag was up in good time, bringing that move to an end. Well, he's just got to be more patient there. He's gone too early. Lo Celso. Di Maria. And that's going to roll all the way through. Lionel Messi tries to lift it well, choosing to chip and it wasn't so very far away well it was good vision, excellent technique but not quite the end result it deserved those stats really do paint the picture so many chances but yet little end product but surely the breakthrough's coming and now they've got to put their minds towards winning the ball back. Ronaldo. On to Neves. Making sure it didn't get past him. They've got it now. What can they do? Ronaldo. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Trying to pick out a teammate. On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Paredes. Di Maria now. He might be able to profit from the wide position. In position, and it's in! We've just witnessed the first goal of this 2022 World Cup final. One to Saber. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Lionel Messi. Bernardo Silva. Di Maria keeps going. Well, didn't go to plan in the end.
Rodrigo de Paul. Nicely timed tackle. Ruben Dias. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. Well, what can we say? All's well that ends well. Well, he's just about recovered the situation. That could have been very embarrassing. Ruben Neves. Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Javier And this is Diogo Jota now. Crossing opportunity. Superb block. No worries for the keeper. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Yes, again, just couldn't seem to maintain possession. Quarter of an hour remaining here. And in the perfect position to read it. What well, a shocking pass, really. Jota just failing to hit the target with his pass and it'll be a throw in so making the substitution now well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that Romero Martinez and he takes on the shot Twists and turns in the closing stages. And it's anyone's guess who's going to lift the trophy. Incredible. Well, here it is again. And that's the perfect volley, isn't it? He strikes it so well. What an excellent finish. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Number seven, Cristiano On the attack, is there to be late drama? And the keeper getting across to stop it. And time for the change now. And over it comes. Just can't get it past him. And so into the final five minutes. Oh, he's lost possession. Bernardo Silva sliding it through. Oh, a goal! And how important could that be? Maybe it's a story of one hand on the trophy at this stage of the final. A huge moment. When we see it again, just look at this pass from Bernardo Silva. And this is Ronaldo at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. Goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Cristiano Ronaldo. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Messi! Oh, terrific save. Well, that's surely it. That was possibly their last chance. What a great save that was. Played over. Well, it has come to nothing. A 
And after the cross, a tremendous block. Teammates in the middle. Now threat about it. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, that break looks so promising, but nothing coming from it. Physically strong and secure on the ball. He's in here. Martinez! Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Well, they have the measure of it, the goalkeeper. And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe. Now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions. And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world. Well, you have to give credit to the coach. He's been excellent, but so too the players and these fans. It's absolutely magnificent for them.